What is up everybody, it's Steve Production here again. Today I'm gonna whip up some delicious jerk chicken with while the camera is over my head recording. You're gonna need all these spices and stuff like lemon juice, cayenne pepper to make your chicken peppery, vinegar, soy sauce, bay leaf, garlic pepper seasoning, grown cinnamon, salt, orchestra shore sauce. Ah, I can't even pronounce the word. Okay, let me just bring up the word. Nice. Thyme leaves, sugar. You guys know what it is, I'ma work my magic at first and put my lemon juice in there, put that in there, I love my lemon juice. Then I put my cayenne pepper in there, boy I'm <coughs> fire later. Some vinegar and a little bit more for good measure and fast forward. Gotta go fast. Now mix it up, oh wait, oh I just realized that a little spill right there. Ah, forget about that. Alright, now let's pour the gravy on there. Mm -hmm. Pour it all over there. Now mix it up. Now mix it up. Alright. Now put the plastic wrap over it. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna put it in the fridge so it stays overnight for 24 hours. Good night, everybody. Be going to my bed. Fast forward the next day. Set oven and bake. And set on 350 degrees. First thing I'm morning. I'm going to go brush my teeth now. After all that, I'm going to just going to take the chicken out of the fridge. I'm going to take the plastic wrap off, and yeah, I should have used the, the cover to cover it, but I don't know why I use plastic wrap. Alright, I'm going to spray this, the pans with the cooking spray. One more spray for good measure. Alright, let's put the chicken. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, Chris. I don't know, I don't know Spanish. Alright, then put the gravy in there. Uh-huh, then put it in the oven. Let it stay there for an hour and a half. Whoosh! Okay, let's check this. Oh, oh burn my hand again. Right. Taste this if, if it's done. Alright. Mm, yeah. Mm, yum, yum, yum. Mm, chum, chum, chum. Tastes good. It's done. And there you have it, everybody. Nice, delicious jerk chicken. Yeah, open style. You can eat this with your rice or mac and cheese or whatever. Please give this silly cooking narrating video a thumbs up if you like and subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys on my next cooking video. Peace out. I'm out.